Hey guys, what's up? Uh, today I am doing the review of the Shang Shao um, 8x8. Um, it, but first, you'll notice that I have this different background. It's the uh, 2014 US National Championship. Um, now, I wasn't actually at Nationals, and I actually really never go to speed cubing competitions just because I have other stuff to do, like work. I have to work, I have to. Um, you know, I have to do gymnastics, I'm a gymnast, if you didn't know that, and so, yeah, if you don't like this background, I can easily switch it, don't worry, I can just, you know, uh, change, use this for my speed cubing, and then use my, um, that other white background as my background if you would like, but, uh, this first video may not be the best because, uh, as you can see, I look really red, no, I normally am red, but, um, I think it's because of the setting on my camera, so I'll have to play around with it a little bit, and uh, we will have to see. So, anywhere, yeah, anyway, <laughs> sorry, back to the review. Um, Shang Shao 8x8 overall turns really nicely, but again, it feels really unstable at the exact same time. Like, I feel like I can, like, easily turn it without it, can, like, without it popping, but just... Like, I don't speed cube it, but even when I, you know, just solving it, it pops a lot. Like, my very first time getting this, I think I may have told you, um, very first time I got this, I actually, like, was testing corner cutting. I, like, was, like, misaligning everything and, you know, seeing if it would corner cut, which it does. But I did it a bit too far, and the whole thing just, like, exploded and fell apart in my hands. And, oh, jeez, I was, I was mad. It took me, like couple weeks to figure out how to put it back together because I didn't look up any videos because I'm an idiot but um so yeah this it it's, it really is a high quality puzzle if you like higher order puzzles it's I think it's a bit pricey I'm not sure my sister got it for me but um so yeah it I think it's maybe fifty dollars sixty dollars something like that I don't know it's it's expensive though um well, at least for, you know, a cube. If you don't like, if you like high order puzzles, it's well worth it, and you should definitely try it out. But if you don't, then, um, you know, don't get it, I guess, but, sorry, <laughs> keep hitting the tripod. Um, so, the corner cutting on this, it's not bad, but it's not great. Uh... Yeah, it's about a piece. Doesn't do line to line though, I don't think. Yeah, no, it doesn't do line to line. Almost does. But, um, you know, every now and then when you're solving, you'll get those few pops. Um, just like with any other cube. And I apologize if I'm going out of camera angle. I'm used to being more up here, but this mat is... I don't know, I can rearrange it later. Whatever. But, um, yeah, so it turns nicely. The shades, I don't really like Shang Shao shades. But I don't really feel like switching them. I'm probably gonna re-sticker it though. But I, I don't. I don't know. I don't want to, but I probably will because of my OCD. It just bothers me that much. So what else? Stickers. Uh, they're all right, but you know they're not the best quality. As you can see, there's a few messed up stickers like this one right here. You can see that one real well. They're all. A little messed up on this yellow side, but that's pretty much it, just the yellow side. I don't know why, but, so yeah, if you don't like the color of this, I apologize. I'm going to try and fix that, maybe while editing, or maybe I'll just play around with the settings. I don't know, but you may also notice little black dots. It's because my 5x5, five five, which is in pieces right now, it just popped uh, all the lube actually got onto the mat for right when I got it. Like, I literally just now got this. I opened it up, and I... <laughs> oh, man, I was mad, though. Because this is going to bother me for a little while until I... So if you, if you know how to get crap like that out, then tell me. But, yeah, so... Uh, what else? What else? What else? Oh, and the inner layers, like these middle layers... Uh, you, you get some grinding. Now, you can fix this, but, you know, I wouldn't really recommend it because it's not that bad, but you can, like, hear it. So 
so yeah, you can probably hear that. Um, now, the colors complement each other nicely, but, you know, again, I don't really like King Shao shades. It's just, it's mainly the blue, no, no, the blue is fine. The orange, the yellow, and the green that I have issues with. I just, I just dislike them. I don't know. Um, now, I could change this up, but, you know, what's the point? So, uh, right now, I'm going to size comparison. Here's a 2x2. Uh, two two. So, yeah, this takes up about five pieces, I think. So, that's a lot bigger. Um, here's a 3x3 three three MOU. Uh, yeah, quite a bit bigger. Um... Let's see the seven by seven. I might be doing on a review on this next. So it's uh, like it's not much. I can tell you that. Like this is that's weird. Like everything's aligned. Like just since you can see it from here, everything's aligned right here. But then like up here. It stops being aligned like right here. That confuses me. <laughs> oh, it's probably the cor the uh, corners. But you can see like everything's aligned up until like right here. Everything starts to get un like misaligned. Like if you know what I mean. Like it's aligned. This line lines up with that one. It matches up, you know. So kind of stops about right there. That's weird. Whatever though. Um, oh, and then here's a four by four. Sorry. Yeah, it's about. Was that six? Yeah, it's six pieces. Almost a little bit more than that, but whatever. Um. So, let's see. I pop out a few pieces here, so I can get it back together afterwards. Oh, no, there we go. Okay, pulled out three pieces. I'm gonna get more lube on this. I'll mess it up. So here's an edge. Another edge fits together like that. And then the innermost edge. Or one of it's the innermost, but whatever. So they fit together like that. And the mechanism is what does the mechanism look like? I think it's a ball core mechanism. It's like the only way you can really do this. Or no, maybe it's a... No, it's... I don't know. Whatever. Oh, God. I hate putting these things back together. <laughs> Jesus. Especially while recording, because I can't... I can't tell what I'm doing. Okay, here we go. Okay, so if I can get this last one in here. Ah, jeez. Probably should have loosened it. Whatever. Oh, and also I'd recommend having loose tensions on this if I were you. Just because, er, sorry, tight tensions. <laughs> loose tensions, bad. Don't do that. Um, because if it's loose, it'll pop so, so much more. But, um, so yeah. If I were to rate this uh, 1 out of 10, I would say a 9 for, like, the amount of fun, I guess. But for quality, I would say about a 7 or an 8. So it's pretty good, but it's not extremely good. You know what I mean? It's not amazing. It's not the best quality you're going to get in a puzzle. Now, a few years ago, before Moe, you started to take over and be, like, the best company out there. This would this would have been the greatest, but yeah. So I think that's it for my review. Um, if you like this video, give it a like. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe. Um, also, tell me if like the way I've been editing my new videos with the music in the last you know half or not the half, but you know there might be music playing right now in the background. And then tell me if you like my uh, outros and intro, and just tell me what I can fix in my channel if you don't like, like what you don't like, just. Tell me what I can and can't, or tell me what I can fix, and then 
you know, if, if it's not all that expensive, I will fix it shortly, but, um, because I have not been working lately, have not been getting paid, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, oh, and if, also, if you like this, um, mat, I got it from thecubicle.us, it was, like, $12, not even, I think it was... It was twelve dollars, but with a discount code JR Cube or whatever. You know, I used like the Cube Dude or JR Cubers thing in the thing in the discount, and I got like sixty cents off or something. But um, so yeah, that would be my review. See you guys later, and I hope you enjoyed this video. So yeah, see you guys later. Bye.